Mexican hunter, along with his wife, will appear before a San Diego federal judge this morning. They're accused of using campaign funds as a personal bank account. 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala is live downtown. And Mimi, Hunter told you yesterday he thinks these charges are political. He told us that he claims that he's being attacked by Democrat prosecutors who are trying to get him out of office, but he says he's not worried. He wants his case to go to trial because he says if it does, he will win. And he's also confident that he'll win the election as well. I'm going to have an election. I'm not resigning. Um, I'm not going to resign with a bunch of leftist uh, government folks throwing allegations at me. There's a there's a trial. Congressman Hunter claiming he did nothing illegal, and that's after he and his wife, Margaret, who was also his campaign manager, were indicted by a federal grand jury on dozens of charges. They're accused of using tens of thousands of campaign dollars on lavish family vacations, like a $14,000 trip to Italy, other household expenses, dental bills, school tuition, and the list goes on. He claims he knew nothing about these purchases and that his wife was in charge of them. Protesters are expected to show up outside of the federal courthouse this morning. The group Indivisible sent us these pictures. It has held demonstrations outside of the congressman's office and under billboards since early 2017, drawing attention to Hunter's criminal investigation and criticizing his purchase of a $600 plane ticket bought with campaign funds used to fly the family's pet rabbit cross country. That group will be here at 930 this morning. The arraignment is expected to begin at 1030. We're live downtown. Mimi Alcala, 10 News.